Hello and welcome to the next episode of the Plug and Play Tactical Experiment with me, Magoobidge. Gateshead Season 8 in the Premier League we are now. We've literally achieved it from Conference North to Premier League 7 seasons, which has been great. And if you've missed any of my other episodes, I've only won one title. That was the very first season. This is a plug and play tactic where the very first game, very first season, we plugged the tactic in. And we haven't touched it since and we're not going to touch it or adjust it or do anything to it. The only thing we do is make subs and shout at the players in game. That's it. So we're in the Premier League, but my window was good to a point, but my defence is shocking. Um, they're not up to scratch, I have to say. The last time you were with me, you saw us draw with Tottenham and draw with Wolves. After that, we drew with West Ham 4-4, 93rd minute equaliser from Callum Wilson, and that was his hat-trick, believe it or not, and he came on as a sub. After that game, we then drew with Fulham, so f four draws in a row. We then lost to Watford, 3-0 at home, then drew 3-3 at home to Chelsea, but look, Matteo Kovacic and Haaland scored in the 90th minute, and they got a 3-3 draw. Nicked the draw, we were 3-1 up, approaching injury time. Uh, we've just beaten Burnley, Callum Wilson again, and Patrizio Bora, who's doing really, really well, who's on loan for Inter Milan, has got his goal. And now we're going to play Everton and Norwich. So as it stands in the Premier League, I'm quite happy. After 11 games, we're ninth on 14 points. Won three, drawn five, lost three. But, as I say, these games coming up are going to be key. We're playing Everton in 12th, then Norwich in 16th. I want four points from these two games. Everton are a decent team. They've got Martial up front. They've got all sorts. So here's the fixtures. So Man City have lost in the lunchtime kickoff to Arsenal. We're actually notified as the favourites ahead of this game. So I've got problems here. My two substitute midfielders have both got knocks. So I'm going to have to change them. Bennett can come into the side for McGinley. McGinley was signed in the summer. But there's there's a these two have got a bit of a... A relationship going on, partnership all last season. McCullum can come on the bench. Can he come on the bench? No, we'll leave it as it is. So the team is Bazanu, Bola, Thompson, Bennett, Clark, Bora, Downs, Pheasant, Coyle, Wing, and Gilliam Berg. But I'm going to bring Callum Wilson in because he's scoring goals. So that's my team. Here we go. My back four is basically the same back four as in the championship. And it's not great. So team talk, assertively say, we owe Everton after what happened in the last game. In the league, um, in the League Cup, sorry, I played a rotated team and got thumped 5-1 at home. So, Gazanu's done really, really well. Thompson's making his 125th appearance and Martial is playing well. Right, play. So let's encourage. There's a, there's a highlight straight from the kickoff. Just have to look at some of their names they've got in their team. Martial's in early. He's put it wide after 15 seconds. they got Pickford, Christensen, Rodri, Mangala. And, as I say, Martial up front. Right, so the highlight. We have a throw broken down. We've picked up second ball. Bowler, the Connor Pheasant, who's not done great so far this season. The, the permanent signing. Had him loan for a few seasons. But, oh, I thought it was a big chance. Callum Wilson just put the ball wide. Great opportunity for us. Let's move us up. We're actually top half, which is good. Clark takes the corner. Back to Callum Wilson. Plays it back to Clark. Cross comes in. And there's Bennett with the header. And we've gone 1-0 up and it stands. It does stand. Brilliant. Great routine. Clark plays it back to Wilson. Controls it. Plays it back to Clark, who's made sure he stayed on side. And then Bennett, Howard Bennett, gets his second of the season. And we're one up at home to Everton. Brilliant. Let's kick on now. As I said, we've got Everton now. Then we've got Norwich next. Games against the big six are just, we just, you know, whatever we can get from them is a bonus. We're probably going to lose all of them. But if we can get wins, even draws, it'll be great. Bowler's gone down the right and he left-hand side, crossed it in, they've cleared it. And they're breaking on the counter-attack. But we've won the challenge. Pheasant's done well. But we've given it away. Martial turns and Martial punishes us again. 11th goal this season already for Martial. We won the ball here, Pheasant. And then Coyle 
gets in the tiz was with Clark, give the ball away, Martial turns the defender, scores. 1-1. One, one. So I want to see some a reaction from the players. Show some passion. Trey Core is not performing this season. He's on a 6.3 so far in the game. Right, Wilson's done well to nick in and win the ball and he's breaking. And he's taken it all away. He's not. He's challenged. Goes back to Pickford who clears it. We've got players out of position and Martial's in again. Martial straight to the goalkeeper this time. But he was offside. Trey Coyle, 6.3. He's my most valuable player in the squad. That's mine. Off the line. Might have to cash in on him. He's not injured and he's not performing. It's one or the other, unfortunately. Right, we're approaching half time and it's one all. We've got a highlight right on half time. Coyle, Clark. And they're going to break. Martial again. Just gone past the defender standing still. Fires it wide. He's the threat. He's the obvious threat. Team talk. Certainly say, we've been the better team. Midfield passionate. You weren't that bad. And the defence and the attack. Start the second half. Demand more. Straight from the kickoff. But Cole's improved to 6.5. Let's see how he gets on. 6.4 again. He does, he's no influence down that right. Downs in the midfield is not either. 6.4. Right, 20 minutes to go. We've actually got a highlight. We've got the throw. Clark takes it. Flicked on. And Callum Wilson has scored his sixth goal of the season. And it's 2-1. Gates said 2. Everton 1. In Brentford Stadium in London. As the home games, by the way. Which is just, um, it's just ridiculous. 2-1. Right, make substitutions. Right, Minamino, you're going to play on the right. Banks coming on for Bora for fresh legs. Then McGinley, I'm going to put you in the middle of midfield because you can play there. Because Downs was having a shock up. Right, demand some more. They've got Mason Greenwood just come on, supporting Martial. If we, we need another goal it, if we can get it, it'll be perfect. Bowler with a long throw. Pickford hesitates. They clear it. It comes to Connor Pheasant. And Connor Pheasant has scored against his old team. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. 3-1. Brilliant result. Think of how many chances we've seen Martial miss. Banks heads it back in. Justin clears it. Pheasant takes the touch. Puts it past Pickford into the corner. We've got him on a steal from Everton for four million in the summer. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Christensen's getting the telling off, and we've got free kick. Eight five minutes gone. Up to McGinley, who's into the middle of midfield, who gives the ball away to Martial. Martial creates save from Bazanu again. Clark get the ball away, and we do. So another long throw from Clark, headed away. Martial's going to collect the ball. Thompson's done well to nick it and he plays it through. And Wilson has beaten everyone. And Callum Wilson has scored again. Outstanding. 4 1. That seventh goal of the season. I signed him for experience. I think he's 33 now. Look at that. Pickford just stood still and he's punished him. 4 1. Wilson's outstanding at the moment. In mid, in, up front, it's literally Wilson plus one more. That's amazing. Callum Wilson's got two. Brilliant. Right. We're breaking on the counter, and Wilson's in. He's away for his hat trick, and he's done it. <laughs> Callum Wilson. <laughs> oh, my word. That's his second hat trick of the season. Talk about clinical finish as well, by the way. Look at this. Inside his own half when he makes the run. No hesitation. Look at that. Pickford, no chance. 5-1 against Everton at home. We couldn't buy a win. That is unbelievable. That is absolutely 
Unbelievable. Callum Wilson, individual praise. Passionate. Your dominating performance today was spectacular. And it was. That is unbelievable. We've just thumped Everton 5 0 at home. At 5 1. Okay, we move on to Norwich in the next game. So after the weekend's fixtures, we move up to 8th place on 17 points, 5 behind Watford, who are in the Europa League places. But we're edging closer to the magical 40. And with that performance, we now got a plus one goal difference. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Let's move forward. We're playing Norwich. It's the weekend's results so far on the Saturday. Big wins for Leicester away at Fulham, who just sacked the manager. And Arsenal, 7-2 at home against West Ham. So coming into this game against Norwich, I've got a couple of players that have picked up injuries while they're away on international duty, which is not great. I need to make one or two test, uh, tests. I'm reading the word test here. Look, one or two changes. So let's have a look at the team. So Downs is not fit. So I need to bring him out. Isaacson comes in for him. Um, so on my, so Bennett is not fit. He's only on 89%. So he'll come out for McGinley. Um, let's have a look here as well. Apart from that, I think we're all good. So that's going to be my team. So it's Bazanu, Bola, McGinley, Thompson, Clark, Bora, Isaacson, Pheasant, Coyle, Wing and Wilson. Can Callum Wilson pick up even more goals to continue his amazing form? This is Callum Wilson, 34. But key areas for a pressing forward, acceleration technique, heading finishing, and strength. It's all going on a decline, but at the minute he's scoring, so he's in the team. Come on, lads, show me what you can do. I've got faith in all of you. If we can get a win here, it'd be amazing. Let's encourage the players. So they've got the corner early. We win the header. <clears throat> Thompson clears it, but they've picked up second ball. Back post, and they've fired it high and over the bar. Get another win here would be amazing if we could. Right, their goalkeeper takes it. They've got loads of space in the middle of midfield. Played the ball over the top. Ola gets back and picks up the ball. Plays it up to wing. Who, who turns, <clears throat> comes inside, but gives the ball away. Thompson stepped in and won the challenge. McGinley had won the challenge. They picked up the loose ball and played it in behind him. And Dolberg has scored his eighth goal of the season for Norwich. Watch this. So Dolberg goes. McGinley steps in, then gets caught. And Dolberg runs off the back of him. He's played in and scores. 1 0 down. Right. Shout. Show passion. I want to see a response. I want a response from these players. 22 minutes in. I haven't got anything yet. They've got another throw. Win the ball. We do. Coyle plays it up to wing. Back to McGinley. McGinley spots Bora on the left-hand side who cuts in. And the goalkeeper makes a great save. Wilson keeps the ball in play. Back to Coyle. Cross comes in. There's Bora. Try to, he waited too long, but he's nicked it. He's done well. He's nicked the ball back, and then he's lost it again. How can you lose the ball twice in the space of seconds? Going to break on us. It's that hesitation. Well, we've won it back. Pheasant has done well. Plays the ball. Wing heads it down to Callum Wilson. Thought he was going to pull the trigger, but the keeper was out and at his feet before he could do so. Right, throw. Bowler takes the throw. Isaacson plays it back to him, and there's a header from Wing, and it goes over the bar. It's a good response from us, but nothing to show for it yet. President's dropped to a 6.4 now. Like team talk. Aggressive. I expect to see a much better showing. Aggressive. I need you to calm down. All departments on the pitch. Start second half. Demand more. I'm keeping an eye on my two midfielders. They're on a 6.5 and a 6.4. McGinley plays it to Isaacson, who plays it up to Bowler, who plays it forward to Bora. 
Boris on his bike. No one's with him. He's hit the crossbar. Goalkeeper beaten. Throw into us. Clark to take the throw. Long throw. Cleared for a corner. Those long throws are causing all sorts of panic. And on every game we've played so far, corner comes in, headed away. Thompson picks it up, back to Clark. Coyle. It comes to nothing. They're going to break. Tackle from Connor Pheasant, but Dolberg picks up the ball again. Plays it to the back post, and we've headed it away. Oh, they shoot wide. Chasing shadows at times, we are. Right, okay, so subs now. Bora on the left is not doing anything. So Scott Banks, you're coming on. No, in fact, Wing's going to swap with Bora and go to left wing. Gillianberg's going to come on up front and play on that left-hand side. I put you on the right and swap Wilson there for now. Dylan Thompson's not playing great, so Bennett's going to come on for Thompson. And then, what do I want to do now? Trey Coyle. I'm going to go Banks for Wilson. That's my changes. Shout, show me passion. Let's get a goal. Get an equaliser. Well, they've got a goal, a free kick deep inside their half. Can we win it back? No, Dolberg's in behind again. He shoots and Bazanu tips it over the bar. They've got the corner. 22 minutes to go. We're one down. Bazanu with a save. Is the highlight going to keep going? No, it doesn't. Shout. Demand more from the players. Can we get something late on? Get creative to the players. They're inspired. Five to go. It looks as though we're going to lose this game. We've got a corner. Clark takes it, swings it in, and they clear and they're going to break. Need to get that ball back. They hit him on the counter again. Clark's done well to win it. And he plays the ball over the top. And there's Gillianberg. And Gillianberg's at the post. How has he done that? Rounded the goalkeeper and hit the post. And then he shoots high and wide. Talk about a missed opportunity. Deary me. Three minutes of injury time to go. McGinley. Inside to Pheasant. Back to Bennett. Bennett lumps it up to Gillianberg. Who turns. Turns the defender. And the goalkeeper saves it again. Corner. Can we capitalise? Can we get an equaliser? Bowler's shot over the bar. 26 shot, shots we've had. 15 on target and we've lost the game. Dressing room. I'm not happy. I'm not happy with the performance. So we are now 10th. And we're 6 points off of 7th place. But most importantly of all, we're 8 clear of the relegation zone. So that's the video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Let's have a look at the schedule. So I'm going to move forward and play two big games. Liverpool away followed by Chelsea on the Sunday the 20th of December and the 28th. That's the next two games, end of December. If you like the video, smash the like button for me, then subscribe to the channel, but make sure you hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss when my videos come out 6 o'clock every day. It's exciting. We're Premier League. Can you believe it? Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.